up there. And this is the point where the dog sniffs the air and pretends that he's going to do a wee every now and again. Wee wee time. Come on. Good boy. Mirror, mirror on the wall. Who's the fairest of them all? <laughs> of course it is me and welcome to another day. It's been a fantastic weekend because I picked up this big gold parcel. Of course it wasn't gold to start off with. It's my mum's 85th, 85th birthday tomorrow. Super excited and we got her a really nice gift. In fact, it's a nice warm winter coat. Okay, time to get some work done. But what's this? Hmm, looking good. A very important part of any video is of course the audio. And you can see on my desk just here, and of course over there, because speakers normally come in pairs, these are the Wavemaster 2 BT speakers or Bluetooth speakers. Now you don't have to use them as Bluetooth speakers, you can use them wide as well. I've got the left one sitting over here, the same distance, either side of the monitor, because I'm like that, it's got to be accurate. And I, yes, I did measure it with a ruler. Look at the beautiful gloss cabinet on here. We've got a little toggle switch here as well to toggle between the couple of inputs on the back and also Bluetooth connectivity. And then we've got this main rotary dial here, which controls the on off and of course the volume. Now this one houses all of the amplifier. The other speaker over there is a passive speaker. So this one's actually plugged into the main. So let's have a listen to how they sound. I think they sound absolutely amazing and the asking price is very reasonable as well for a speaker that sounds this good I'm very very impressed I'll leave a link to the manufacturers website down there in the video description now I showed you those awesome Wavemaster speakers in the editing room and I just find it amazing and I'm just sort of very thankful that I've gone from having what was a, a simple desk, a very simple single desk setup, to having both an editing room and a studio. Very, very blessed and I'm super thankful for that. The desk that I use in the studio, if you're not familiar with it, is this one here. This is the uh, Blue Lounge Studio Desk and it's absolutely fantastic. Now I don't have any computer on there at the moment, but that will be changing, no doubt, in 2016. I'm tied to the studio today, so I like to work in different places. And I have got plenty of emails to do. Got to get on with that. Got this in the post. This is really cool. This is from Earnshaw or Thomas Earnshaw and it is a nice gold pen. Awesome. Looks like a ballpoint pen, not a rollable. Very blingy. Thank you very much, Thomas Earnshaw. And also, to catch you up on what I did at the weekend, this is The Walk. And I was very kindly sent this by Sony to watch. And it's a really awesome movie. It's about this French guy who walks on ropes and he looks for the ultimate thrill and wants to extend this rope between the Twin Towers in New York. And uh, it's just an absolutely fantastic movie. I won't give you any spoilers, but it's a definite must watch. Now, I've ordered some lights to go into the editing room because I intend to do more recording in the editing room this year. 
and I've ordered them from Ikea, but Ikea charge so much money for delivery. I've ordered from them before, and in fact, uh, you, you have to be very careful when you're ordering from Ikea, the amount you put in the basket obviously determines the delivery charge. And I've had instances where I've added just one small item and it's put the delivery charge up from £7.50, which seems to be their minimum, up to about £30. So sometimes it's cheaper to do your IKEA orders in two separate orders. So just experiment a little bit with adjusting the quantity in your basket. Okay, I really need to focus, get these emails done. Okay, wow, in the last 20 minutes, I've got 28 emails to go through. That is so many. I keep getting distracted. I'm going to show you this pen again. I didn't show you up nice and close. This is this Earnshaw pen that I showed you a little bit earlier. Just look at how gorgeous that is. Absolutely fantastic. Very, very blingy. Absolutely love it though. Now, I am stuck in the studio today. Let me just do these emails. A lot of them are junk email, get rid of that. A few offers of products to review, just so, so many. Now, I mentioned to you earlier, or actually I showed you that gift for my mum. It's her 85th birthday tomorrow. And we've got one more gift waiting to be delivered today. And isn't it just typical, when you've got nothing to do your deliveries will come all in really good time sort of all in the morning i have got so much that i need to get done outside and i'm tied to the studio because i'm waiting for this delivery and you can bet your last penny that this courier delivery will come right at the end of the day time to catch up on one of my new favorite shows in all seriousness i absolutely love this show so the courier was on my side and I cannot wait to see my mum's face when she opens her gifts tomorrow. Of course, I love my own birthday, but I love other people's birthdays even more. I love seeing the look on their face and the smile and the reaction to the gifts when they open them. I really do. I like other people's sort of happiness. And on that note, I wish you a really happy day wherever you are. See you again tomorrow. such a sexy sexy speaker hmm smooth <laughs>